Hey guys, this is Aubrey. He's a salesman and he has terrible brain fogs, killing him. Can't sleep, vertigo, he headaches, he has neck pain, can't work out. Found us on YouTube. So we did some exam on him, testing his neck here. You can see he's in pain. We also checked his low back here. Now he's showing us his pain when he's bending over and he's leaning back here. You can see it too. His x-rays suck. Tons of arthritis, way too much for his age, bone growth in the muscle. We adjusted him and kabinga. So my name is Aubrey. I am 39 years old and I'm a sales representative for California Deluxe Windows. I've been, I've been going okay, through yeah. a lot of pain. How many years you had pain, sir? Over 20 years. I've actually seen a lot of your videos and like I said, I've, I've like I mentioned earlier, I've been skeptical about the whole chiropractic uh, uh, procedures, but after watching your videos, it actually opened up my eyes and thinking, you know what, receiving a lot of like excru excruciating pain throughout my body this past couple months, I figured, okay, let me, yeah. Check this guy out. Yeah, stops me from doing a lot of things, um, especially uh, workout routines, um, sleep. Uh, I, I have trouble sleeping, um, focusing, concentrating. Um, I, you know, sometimes I can't. You even, forgot already. I forgot what I was going <laughs> to say. You know, just sitting in the car driving, I start feeling this pain because I'm like in a certain positions. Yeah, yeah. Look at his body. Okay, see how he stands. You can see his kind of rounded shoulders. You can see how his his body is separated right here. Go turn the side right here. And I want to show, show this. He just has the classic stance of somebody who thinks that exercise and strength will help him. And that is actually the furthest from the truth. He puts his body in a position where it just absolutely tears him apart. Let's do these tests now. I'm going to push down. How much you feel? Any uh, pain in your neck there, sir? Yeah. Where? Um, around this area. Right there? Yeah. How uh, about this one? Yeah. Where? Right here. Gotcha. And this one? Mm. Um, right here and then here. <laughs> Which one was worse now, the left side or the right side? Uh, I think it was the left. No back pain? No. Okay, move your hands please. How about that one? No. no. Cross your leg? Uh, Not really? Yeah, right A little here. hip right there? Yeah, gotcha. up. This one? Back pain at all? No. Okay, this one? No. And this one? Uh, right here a little bit. Face down? Yep. Okay. Which side is worse, right or left? Left. Left? Yeah. Okay. How about this one? That hurt at all? Uh, yeah. More here? Yeah, more there. Or more on the left? More in the center. Center? Gotcha. How about this up here? Right there. Right here? Yeah. How about this one here? Uh, shoulder's starting to hurt. Gotcha, right here? Yeah. Now more pain here? Yeah. Or is there more pain down here, sir? More pain on top. Now I'm pushing your neck, how much you feel? More here? Or more here? More there. More there? Yeah. So, more here or more here? Oh, yeah, that really hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I think you really exposed it. Any pain in your back there, sir? Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much is it? Uh, I'll give you that a 5. How much pain there, sir? Yeah, I give that I give that 7. Other way? Other way now? Oh. Call me the way there? Uh, 8. Other way? Probably the way there? Uh, that'd be an eight. Down? Yeah. How much pain there? Yeah, that's definitely a nine. How about that? Nine. Nine also? Other way? Eight? Yeah, it's an eight. What about that? Which one's worse, left or right? Like going left is right, going left is more? Yeah. And how much, nine also? I'll give it an eight. Sneezing, sneezing would actually start hurting, hurting my neck. Gotcha. Same or different from side to side? Okay. That's what you Different. Which is which? Uh, this one. I one felt left. Mm -hmm. Left. Left. Uh, same. Open your hands. Same. Okay. Left. Left. Uh, same. Thirty-five. 35, 25, 35, 25, 13. Go back until your butt touches. Right here. Move to your left a little bit. Okay, move back to your right a little bit. Too much, too much. Right there. Good, right there. Stay relaxed. Anxiety a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, so uh, just relax. Look straight ahead here. Where is the pain exactly? 
um, like around the shoulder area. Gotcha. And then uh, I, I get like dizziness, especially I, I have trouble sleeping. Yeah. Again, he's so messed up, his brain fog is messing with the most, I think. Yeah. And so he doesn't remember shit. Mm -hmm. And so uh, in the previous video, you'll see him like having trouble remember what I'm, I'm even saying. And you can see him having a struggle with it right now. So take a deep breath right now. How, is that difficult at all? Does it feel difficult? Not too much, but at times it hurts in certain gotcha. joints and areas. So take a deep breath in your nose. Good. You guys can see that. How about your low back? Uh, yeah. Right. On a scale of one to ten, what is that? Uh, I'll give it a seven. Got your back like this, sir. How about yeah. that one? About a nine. A nine. Uh, look at the floor. How about that in your neck? Mm, nine. Nine. Look at the ceiling. How about that? Nine. Knees. How about the knees? How much in the knees? Scale of one to ten. About a six. And then in the back, go ahead one more time. How about the back? A seven. Please. About a six? Mm, gotcha. About a six. The x-rays are pretty bad. I mean, he, he's 39 years old, but they look more like a 60-year-old already. Lots and lots of pressure in there, lots of reasons why he's here. And Aubrey has a lot of stuff. 16 degree scoliosis and occiput tilt here. Six millimeter short left leg, 12 degree scoliosis here. Here's the big stuff. One half atlas wear, bad arthritis, bone growth in the muscle. Here we have arthritis and constipation. Let your head roll to the left, please. Good. Good. Wow. Man. Why don't you tell them what that experience is? Very right. good. Better. Yeah. Way better. Show it a little bit. Yeah. Whoa. There we go. Whoa. I like to make a special point of helping my vertigo patients up because they're always a little off tilted here. And so we're going to listen in and see how Aubrey's doing. I think he's doing a little better. Let's listen in close. I feel actually really, I feel like everything's cleared up right now. And as far as like vision wise, like I can see colors better. Um, I don't see like those circles, like those colored circles. Um, so everything looks brighter. A point most chiropractors forget to do is recalibrate the spine. Walking is paramount to spreading that spine adjustment from the top to the bottom. Let's check in. I feel a little bit taller. <laughs> yeah, crazy, right? Yeah, yeah, because I'm used to hunching a lot. Um, it feels easier to stand. Yes, uh, I'm not feeling, I mean, my the my pain was from like 90 to like almost 45 percent right now so i'm not feeling that much pain as i felt earlier well just give us an idea how much percentage wise are you better now than when you walked in here um i feel like, uh, like good wise I, f I feel almost 85 85 percent yeah yeah and so how many years you've been suffering with this uh wow over 20 years yeah even more yeah. how much pain you're back there that was uh May seven i think a minute ago yeah, it's uh, like a four right now. Four? Not mm -hmm. like this? That was a nine, I think. Yeah, now it's like a five. I mean, I still feel a sensation, but not as bad. Yeah. Look at the four, please. How about that? Wow. Um, I get this like, um, like a six. Give it like a six. Now squat, please. <coughs> what about that? Um, barely anything. Your knees? Was uh, six just, four. It was now it's like a three. And the back? Better too, right? Um better. Much better. Now left arm straight over your head, please. That was a six. Give it like a three. I mean I can feel a little tingling, but not that much. Now the thing I want you guys to notice with him is how much clearer his eyes look. <laughs> look in the camera. <laughs> I mean, look, look at how much more paying attention he is. Yeah. I mean, you can see it. He was not even paying attention a few minutes ago, and now he's, and now he's, you know, back in black! <laughs> <laughs> so we got one more test to do, one more test. Okay, Aubrey's not listening to me. Oh, sorry. And he's not following through with care, but we'll see how he's doing. So he had one treatment, and it's a week later, which I definitely tell you not to do. And so I want to know how you've done, because uh, just tell us, just give us the overview of what's gone over the last week lasted for like a couple of days. How are you today versus last week when you came in? Not as bad as last week. Okay, so how much Not, better are you overall? Um, 10%, I would, 20%? I would say, I would say maybe 10, 10%. Not putting your time in, you're only gonna get small results. Yeah. Okay, small. how about the left arm? Uh, left arm is fine. Um, arms are okay. Dizziness every day? Um, not too much as um, as before. Gotcha. And you yeah. have headaches every day. How about that? I do get partial headaches 
Um, but it's not as bad as it was with breathing the and brain fog. How about that? Breathing is okay. Brain fogging is like less than usual. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. And that was the big thing you came in for. Mm -hmm. just... Wow. Mm -hmm. I forgot. Was it tight like that last time? Um, it was worse last time. Why did it feel good, by the way? Who cares? Um, I what? just feel liberated. Just, After that adjustment? Yeah. Even though you could hardly hear it, guys. Wow. Wow. That was a lot more. Yeah. That felt so good. Looks <laughs> very good. I feel so much better. Um, I, I don't feel any pain um, for now. Um, I'm learning my lesson. I hope so. <laughs> again, I'm not trying to make. I'm not trying to pick up personally. Again, it's the idea of him not putting the time in. And we, how many times have we discussed this time thing with you? I, I would say maybe twice. Three I times. mean, I kept telling him over and over, "Don't yeah. start, don't start, don't start." Yeah. You have the time. Mm -hmm. And again, I love money like the next guy. But if I, I'm trying to give you the best opportunity to get the to, to get the maximum out of my treatment, and the maximum out of my treatment is doing what I tell you and putting it in a time mm -hmm. where I can actually teach you something. When you come out here, be ready to work. Be ready to work. Yeah. Any questions? Yeah. No. Great. Good. See you guys.